Tina la poscona. Hula pala fala. Runa moriliting. Hula limona bana. Besa besa ngama waza waza. Tina slupi soba sapaza. Oh, 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 oh. Still 
if I can pay you. Your presence like an angel, sound like a brand new home. So, obsessed. Hmm. I'm on my toes. Because I'm short. <laughs> mm. This is so good. Mm. So, <clears throat> from the last vlog, you'd remember I bought these from Discam, which is what I usually do. Um, however, one of the ones that I bought was, uh, the mixed berries one, which I don't like because there's these other berries in there, the small red ones. I don't know what we call them. They have pips inside, which is like very distracting. If you drink this, I prefer mine, um, on the smooth side rather than just having that aftermath of the pips and stuff in my mouth. So I basically took them out this morning. I literally took all of those out and I was left with the other berries. I also need to go, I usually add syrup in here. I need to buy the sugar-free syrup. I saw on Instagram, you know those ads that they usually put on there. There's a company, I think it's called One Sip, One Sip something. It's in Randburg. I'm gonna go there um, afterwards when I'm done. Mm. And then get two of those which they are actually cheaper than this because this is 199 so this is like 200 rand um magnificent barista boys which i get from at home it's really nice i love it however the ones that i saw on that instagram ad that company um it's 115 for 750 mils and this one is 500 mils so it is cheaper because it is also um bigger in quantity so i'm gonna go try those ones also because they are sugar free so yay um because i love syrup in my coffee i also love putting a little bit of syrup in here as well because berries are generally not sweet at all um also it's not sweet but it just gives it like a little bit of something and i also add the macadamia peanut butter which i love like it gives this thing like some serious cream i have tried this with um the plain i have tried the smoothie with the the yogurt the plain yogurt hate it hate it hate it hate it i mean it tastes like i must say i just don't get it yeah, I know some people do that, but I'm not going to do that. I prefer just using milk. Um, so I just changed my milk uh, because of digestive issues. I just have a lot of digestive issues. And I don't even know if it's the milk. Literally, it's it's everything. It's probably it's just probably genetic. But I just want to assist my digestive system. So I've put the normal milk on the side for now. And I'm just consuming the oat milk macadamia milk i don't like almond milk so i don't i'm never gonna buy that one i'll either do oats or macadamia but i prefer macadamia okay anyway let me not blab let's um do the grocery haul <laughs>
these are the groceries <laughs> for this month um i got a the usual you know my staples as you know like this yogurt this like this i always make sure i've got like one extra one because i know we love this so again please buy this i promise i promise you'll love it and then everything bagel sprinkle i also love this i'm almost like out of this so i decided to to buy another one love 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 it i usually get um boneless skinless thighs which i always get from pick and pay i never find them from anywhere else especially like this um the 1.5 kgs so yeah that's the one that i buy because i don't really like breast much i prefer boneless skinless thighs um over breasts and then to my shock and surprise like and get bored it's a german i was like what is this um, <laughs> i thought i was buying the you know not the bigger bigger one but the one after this one uh, yeah maybe because i may probably didn't notice the price and as it but also it was on special uh, yes in i don't know i don't know but in general, my intention was not to buy money my intention was to buy the the medium size one but yeah anyway i don't use it much much but still i don't want to like keep buying it and then uh, fresh produce um veggies which i usually buy from uh woolworths and then um i'm always nervous to buy ever from woolworths because they can either give you the one with the black skin or the one with the green skin i don't know why they don't separate them because i'm just like i don't like the green skin um evo so it's like well whichever one is there they just give it to you and then as you know my meal i'm on a tuna <laughs> tuna kick with my pokeball so i got that as well and then yeah just everything else is basically the usual regular regular staples and then checkers was kind enough <laughs> to include this rugby ball inside so yeah i will get when i rugby ball now so i want to play with that and then um let's do cleaning stuff cleaning detergents um okay this is just for my bag you know if you have kids it's always best to always have wipes it's just that and then she like takes them and does weird things but anyway that's for my bag this time around i have to say i'm going to shift the weights mama this time around at pick and pay um they didn't have my usual regular regular special which i'm not happy about at all like i don't want to lie um so although these were on special uh, the price was reduced however i didn't get a two for however much you know two for however much so the price of the omo was actually just three rands more than this one so i just thought just to make my heart feel a little better <laughs> i got two sunlights and then two omo and then this is the these are the refuse bags that i use from Woolworths. i love them because they have a drawstring and they are long they accommodate my bin because my bin is quite long i had to top up on the cheek as well and then these were on special thank the lord i bought two from pick and pay and the other from checkers which didn't match up the price was exactly the same for two two it was 100 rand and then these bad boys over here i still have some at the top so i, I just topped up on two of these because obviously it works we use this much more than the other ones and then just one handy andy one domestos because we still have three of each so i just thought four is on the safe side needed to re-up on the clear view mr sheen for the shower and then in the fave actually i shouldn't have bought this mm, because as i said the last time wait girl because as i said the last time um that this is never on special and one of you guys commented and said i should try is it crazy plastics i think she said crazy plastics um damn i forgot actually but i'll do that i'll go to crazy plastics and then just re-up maybe on my two three and then yeah and then and then i should stop buying it like gakulu from here because it's usually expensive um and then i got the raid i think we have one left so i just bought two because a hey, sana it's that season of ants baba like yo this we use it mostly for ants because abo gelba tita and then you just find a group of ants there so we need this for that ah <sighs> yeah that's it that's all the groceries that i got groceries this month were pretty expensive 
like pretty when i look at what i spent last month and which i pretty much bought similar things in fact even less because last month i bought a whole lot of like domestos and handy endies and stuff but i still paid more this month than i did last month i don't even want to say how much it's crazy but yeah anyway anyway um let's pack away the groceries then <laughs> Oh, okay. Then that's easy. Yeah, in Zanzibar. Yeah. 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 What even you have a shy? I'm Chan. Right on Chan. I'm born. I'm not alone. I'm Chan. 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 I'm Oh, yeah, we are. Oh, no. Okay, what's the vanilla and caramel. Okay. Okay. Change your room. Just get to the time you want to watch. Okay. All right. Thanks. Hi, Tim. Jen. That's interesting. What is that? Oh, it's a camera. <laughs> I'm vlogging for YouTube. I'm a YouTuber. Have a wonderful weekend. Thanks That's so much. <laughs> Bye. Hey, boys. Hey, boys. I got these things for free, y'all. Oh? I am 
so hungry hey y'all how you doing welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new here if you're an og hey city hey honey welcome back Bam! Welcome back to another video, guys. I'm basically here to show you guys the few things that I got today. Um, and then we can then just close out the vlog. I am so hungry. The last time I ate was that smoothie. I obviously want to show you what I'm having because it's the same. I'm going to have that... Um, uh, what you call the... The poke bowl. Um... But possibly without the rice, I think just with the um, with lettuce. Mm. Mm. What should I start with? Okay, let me start with this one because this one warms my heart. <laughs> mm. It's so heavy. It is so heavy. So these are the iced teas and the um syrups that i went to buy from i'll put the details here from isip i actually saw um the company isip on my instagram page you know as you're scrolling by and then boom you know sugar-free syrups which i've been wanting um so i thought to myself hey i'm gonna go there i had an option to actually order online but something said no and I mean, again, I don't have a problem with ordering online. I love ordering online. So, but something said, go there, drive there. The place is in Randburg um, at Skynet Business Park. Skynet Business Park. I'll just confirm the proper details, guys, because I feel like I don't remember them quite well now. Um, however, I went there and I wanted the vanilla and caramel syrup. So I wanted to buy two. Also, because... The price is really compatible, uh, competitive. The price is really competitive, um, you know, against the ones that I usually buy from at home, which are um, a little more expensive. So, yeah, let me quickly show you. And then this beautiful old man. I hope he doesn't mind me calling him an old man. But, wow, I think he's the owner. I'm assuming that he's the owner of ISIP. He literally gave me everything for free okay when he was packing my box away he was like oh um i'm gonna give you some iced teas to try at home and then i thought okay so he's just giving me the iced teas for free so obviously i'm gonna pay for the syrups can't you know he's giving me everything for free literally everything for free i don't know why i don't but i'm just happy and i'm just appreciative i am in awe like i am so humbled and as we continue because like seriously you gave me your products for free um and i found them they were so busy they were packing away like a lot of orders there was an uber guy there to collect like a lot of orders as well he like left with a lot of boxes so bless him bless his business yo like i am so humbled you guys you have no idea honestly i wasn't expecting it i honestly wasn't expecting it i've got six things so basically i've got four iced teas hello i'm not a tea per a person but i'm keen on trying the iced teas um he says they're concentrated i think you have to mix them with water all right let's start with syrups i bought one caramel and one vanilla um this is the vanilla flavor you see how big it is it's like it's much bigger than the one that i usually buy and it's cheaper and it's sugar free so hello i'm gonna have this without like feeling bad um also because i love putting a little bit of syrup in my smoothies so hey now hey that's what it looks like that's the company i thought it says i sip but it just says sip there i'm not sure what dynasty is about dynasty i don't know what dynasty is it there's the name dynasty there um at the at their offices so i don't know at their shop but yeah anyway that's the vanilla flavor and then that's the caramel syrup. I want to buy those um, dispensable dispensers, the coffee syrup dispensers from Shein. I, I didn't know my Shein cart has like a lot of things. Um, whenever I decide to buy, I am definitely going to buy them so that I can decant because I can't put this big thing over there. It's going to look ridiculous. So I'm going to have to see for now up until i buy the those decanters and then i can use them um over there as opposed to this because this is just huge i'll just keep this in the cupboard so yeah those are the syrups and then these are the iced teas that he gave to me for free 
these iced iced teas are also sugar free so the company also says dynasty dynasty I'm, I'm hoping the tea has something to do with that it says rooibos iced tea concentrate so this is a an iced tea concentrate you mix it with water it says it makes you dilute one to six what makes 5.25 liters i'm guessing the whole thing but this is a concentrate so you have to definitely definitely mix it with water there's no way you can drink this on its own i guess we'll just eyeball it <laughs> at this stage this is the cranberry flavor um and then there's also the strawberry flavor of the iced teas and then there's the mixed berries flavor so keen on trying these honestly and then there's the peach iced tea flavor so keen on trying these okay oh the, i think yeah these are the instructions so you don't have to eyeball it actually um it says sip me hot so you add 400 sorry one. you add 40 mils of your favorite concentrate to a cup of hot water and then yeah so 40 mils of this uh of this concentrate and then you can either have it cold as well if you want to have it cold it says add 50 mils of your favorite concentrate to a glass fill with water or soda water add chunks of ice it's a great refreshing drink that's what they said and then it says here savor me frozen so you can also have it frozen add 300 mils of ice 80 mils of your favorite concentrate into your blender blend together to make a delicious frizzle oh wow actually i'm gonna try that because it's gonna like be cold so i'm gonna add ice and then the concentrate into the blender and gube he freeze or you know oh wow okay actually i'm definitely gonna try that keen on trying that yeah so that's it like yeah i'm i'm really like happy honestly about this so 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 excited even though i'm not a tea girly but still this is a beautiful gift that i was not expecting and i'm definitely gonna use it like i'm definitely definitely gonna use it i know i'm gonna enjoy it and then yeah now let me show you what i got from unique remember that clip that got lost in that other vlog that i didn't post because i didn't have content like all the content was like gone um in that that video that i couldn't post because of the content that got lost yeah i did go to unique so i'm not shopping from unique for the first time i've shopped there before just that you guys don't know because the content don't know i am so hungry you guys I went to Unique and influenced. Um, I actually saw these linen items from Tandy Mzamo's vlog. She was at Unique um, and I saw them like in her clip and I was like, hmm, okay, I'm keen on, I'm keen on trying those. So I'm going to go to Unique and see what it is that they have. And I bought myself a bunch of things. Let me tudula them. Hi, Nami, get a bunch. It's not a bunch it's just a few items but i have to say unique is not cheap eh? sana unique is not cheap um you think because it's checkers you know but they are quite cheap okay this is my this is my coupon i need to keep this very safe in my bag i need to redeem this from checkers you think because it's checkers, you know, they're probably like reasonably priced and all of that, but they are not. They are not cheap at all. Actually, what I'm excited about as well is that I saw oh, so there's a unique store that will be opened at Foy's Mall. So I'm really excited for that. Um, I saw it when I went to at home. Um, it, it's actually just going to be next to, well, opposite um, Checkers. Checkers is on the one side and then Unique is just going to be at the corner next to Browns. So I am so excited uh, because at least now we're going to have a variety. Maybe that one is going to be bigger. I don't know. But the one at Danefern Square is also quite big. They do have a variety of clothing items as well. They like keep a lot of linen clothing wear. So yeah, they just have their own vibe. I think Unique just has its own vibe J going on first up is this top like i'm definitely gonna wear this with g like i'm gonna wear this i'm gonna wear all this clothes clothing me clothing items up or down so first one is this linen is this linen because i keep saying linen but i think it is or is it a blend of material ah 
linen. Of course, I know my clothing items. 100% linen. I think that's why it is also like expensive. Because I was thinking in my mind, it cannot be a blend because these items are not cheap at all. Anyway, the first one is this one. I got it in a medium. Um, it has a button details over there on the sides, which I think is like really cute. I mean, as you can see, this can be worn very casually or like very formally like i can wear this with straight cut pants formal straight cut pants i can wear this with jeans and it would still look absolutely bomb.com i know i never share the prices but yeah anyway just to give you an idea if you've never shopped at um unique um and then the second one i know it's the same kind of color it's okay these are my colors these are my colors and then i got this one um this one is a little bit different because it has a collar and then it, it does have um a wide opening here on the arms and then it's it looks like it's folded lana uh, pansy and then it just has that little detail over there which i think is also really cute obviously you guys are gonna see me rocking this this whole summer spring second item and then this one i almost left but i was like no 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 hey now you're buying cool is this gonna fit yeah but it is uh, i don't know okay anyway i bought this in a large why does it look so huge <laughs> why does it look so huge i know i didn't even fit they look really big these are long long shots is there something like that yeah long shots always their name for long shots but yeah they are a little bit on the longer side they are not like short 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 uh, they have that pattern you fold the gala at the bottom giving i'm not sure it's gonna fit i love them if they don't fit i'm gonna go take another size they look big but sometimes with me you know, i think something is big and then i fit it and it's like exec exec anyway and then i got these green ones these ones are actually different from the ones that i showed you the design is different um yeah one of these ones first of all don't have a rubber here at the back and then they have like pleats here those ones um okay yeah, they do have nyana somewhat of a pleat but this one is like a really the pleat is there like you can see it it's prominent unlike in the other one it's so it, it is different actually it's not just the difference in color but the, the way that it is designed is very different it looks like that this one and is this one is i think a little bit shorter than that one it's not like a long long short but similar vibes similar vibes can't wait to try this and it can actually even pair well um with this it doesn't have to be like um monochrome look i know i always do monochrome looks but you can do it like that and then lastly this is so cute and then this one, the greens, by the way, are not the same. I'm not sure if they're coming off. But probably you can see that they're not the same. So I wasn't thinking like that. I was just thinking, this is cute. I love it. Um, I'm trying to see. Let's see, is it also 100%? No, it's not 100%. Actually, this one is not even linen. Actually, because Villa was like, why does it feel stiff? This one is cotton. Is a mixture of cotton and leosal. I don't know what leosal is. Anyway, it looks like that. And then it has a zip at the back. I mean, this is like chilled vibes. I'm running errands. Mosiso serious. Mosiso tanda. Mosisi. Omoche o cute. O tandis and tezinte. Nizmamele. I've got class. Like this gives all of that and more, honey. Gives all of that and more. It can be worn down or up any kind of way you like. Hi, Bo. I love this. I love all of them, actually. This one is $3.99. This one, I'm not sure of the size as well. I wanted to take a 14, but a 14 looked huge. I was like, hey, now you ask this Hi, no. Just take a 12. So let's see if a 12 will actually also fit. This one is $4.99. So I'll fit them and then see what do they actually like fit, especially the pants. And then lastly, I know I've been recording for a while. Hope you guys don't mind. As I was passing by, I saw um a perfume stand and i thought yes let me go check it out because i have been meaning to buy myself a perfume i've run out of my jo malone and you know that one is expensive <sighs> like i need to gear my mind before i can buy that one and i do want to buy the bigger one so it is quite pricey so for now i thought i just want a nice perfume yeah, that's gonna keep me going anyway let me show you this perfume that i got it's literally the first perfume he made me smell i didn't even 
I thought I was gonna go through, but I was in a hurry because I needed to be somewhere. So I couldn't go through all the smells, which is very impulsive of me. But I just loved the first one that he that he he made me test out. It spoke to me. It smells similar to the Joe Malone one. And that one also has like some Tonga vibes, has some musky vibes, which is my vibe, right? So when he said this, he was just explaining it. He just decided which one to give. And I was like, oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Because also one thing about me is that if I go through different perfumes, like smelling different perfumes, I get confused at some point. I'm like, which one is which, you know? So, but yeah, the, actually I didn't even ask them a lot of details and stuff. I should have asked them if they actually have a store or an online store, if not a physical store, where we can purchase this. But yeah, anyway, it's called Africa Perfume. So he did, he was explaining. It's just that because being chakir, it? But I did hear him say that um, some of the ingredients are from Afri other African countries. I think this one, he said Namibia. But yeah, one of the African countries, he mentioned that some of the ingredients are from there. So, oh, he put a business card as well in here. Africa Perfume, Affluence, Excellence, Appreciation. Oh, do they have a... It doesn't look like they have a website. They do have um, um, social media pages, though, on Instagram. Is this two? What is this? TikTok, huh? Okay. Instagram, TikTok, and then Facebook. And then there's a cell phone number. So... Yeah, anyway, I'll put the details in the in the description bar if you want. But it smells great, you guys. It smells great. They have two sizes. Um, this one is how many meals? Okay, Indoya does not say. Okay, anyway, the packaging doesn't say how many meals. But it's the smaller bottle and there's a bigger bottle to this. Um, I wonder which the design looks like the, the Christian Duo perfumes. Yeah, I wonder the bigger Christian Duo perfume. Half of that is their big size. And then there's this one here. Yeah yeah so this one is the namibian meyer meyer guys like he ne? oh yeah he did say namibia i was right i remembered okay sometimes my brain fails me mm, guys this is my scent this one really smells like mm, like it's so close to that um um that German one perfume. Oh, I love it. And it has coffee extract. And Jay, like it smells really great. And then, yeah, that's it, you guys. I am not even going to show you what I'm going to eat, as I said, because it's exactly, you know, what I had the other day, what I showed you in the other vlog. Because, Mina, I'm like, you know, a dog with a bone, Sana. If I find something that I like, I'm going to eat that thing over and over and over and over again. Um, and I also obviously don't want it to be like repetitive and boring for you guys to keep seeing the same thing um i hope that's not the case if i do show it like gaunini so sometimes i don't show it because i feel like oh i did show it and then now i'm showing it again da, 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 da. but yeah tell me how you feel about it anyway thank you so much for tuning in thank you so much for your love sorry that this part was a little bit long because there were a couple of things that i needed to show you i hope you guys don't mind thank you for your love thank you for your support thank you for always rooting for me thank you for the beautiful comments you guys are top two not two like your comments are the best i absolutely love them i'm challenging you again now you know i'm speaking to you. you can feel in your heart that i'm talking to you you know you're supposed to drop a comment something in you says drop a comment but when are you keep pushing back no man don't push don't push it back do it just do it <laughs> i'd love it so much if you do um and yeah to everyone who's new we are growing a road to 5k um i'm so excited you know i don't know when we're going to reach 5k but we are currently at 4900 and something hi Ken. We are currently at 4,900 and something, so we are slowly getting there. Let's subscribe. Please, if you know you keep coming back for more content and you're not subscribed, do the right thing and subscribe because the analytics still do say that there are some people who watch the content um, outside the you know, outside the family, they are not subscribed. So I'm challenging you to subscribe, especially if you do enjoy the content. Alrighty then. Um, that's it for this week's vlog. Thank you so much for tuning in. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.